so we're almost ready to go. There are just two more areas to cover before we're all set to get the best use out of the HS5 mixer. Firstly, while it's pretty obvious that you can turn up the reverb knob for each individual A to D section to increase or decrease the reverb effect on an individual basis, it's important to know that you can also change the type of reverb to something more or less dramatic as desired. To change the type of reverb to one of the reference options shown on screen, I'll hold the B and C sections input buttons in at the same time and choose number 4 called Large Hall by rotating the A button to the number 4 position. While still holding in the B and C section's input buttons, I'll also rotate the D knob to the right, which will increase the volume level of the reverb effect overall when in this edit mode. So now we have a big saturating reverb effect to work with.